different. Well, first of all, thanks again for coming. <laughs> you guys are really a valuable part of this entire process. And today is a very exciting day for the Department of Transportation. While voters are headed to the polls, we also want the public to head to their phones and be a part of the process to vote and rename the Business 40 route. To tell us a little bit more about that is our division engineer, Mr. Pat Ivey. Thank you, Miracle. I appreciate that. Good seeing you all here today. Uh, DOT asked and the public responded uh, in terms of names, potential names for Business 40. The nomination period uh, for the naming began in November of last year and ended on January 30th and, uh, and we received almost 1,900 nominations from the public, uh, which is uh, amazing. And of course, as we've said before, we've never done this before. But this is the first time NCDOT uh, has done something like this in uh, getting the public and asking the public to name a DOT highway. This is very unique, but Business 40 is a very unique project. On March 4th, our selection committee, composed of residents of Winston-Salem, Kernersville, and representatives of NCDOT selected four finalists from the list of nominations uh, out of the top 10 vote getters of the 1900 names that were submitted. Uh, NCDOT does thank everyone for his or her enthusiastic participation and creative suggestions. Some of those, of course, included names like the Hot Glaze Highway, the Dash, the Moravian Interstate, and uh, many, many others. But, uh, but we did, uh, they did select the top four names. Voting is now open to the public today and will be open for the next 90 days. And I've asked Miracle if she would to come up and sort of give a rundown of what the rules are for the voting. Miracle? Okay. All right, folks. Well, as you can see, the, um, the public can vote in one of three ways. You can either dial on your landline to vote to this number, make sure that you listen to the prompt, speak very clearly to choose the name that you want um, for the highway. You can also use your cell phone and text to this number. Depending on which of the four selections you choose, you'll be texting the corresponding telephone number. You can also go online to our project website, which is Business 40 and C, and there you will be able to vote. Now, there are some rules. It's not all fun. Um, <clears throat> voting is going to start today, right now, so you can log on and voting, voting is available, and it's going to go for the next 90 days. On June 15th, voting is over. There are no write-ins, there are no recalls. This isn't that type of voting process. It's going to be over 90 days. Now, all residents of the metropolitan area are eligible to vote, and um, but you can't vote more than 10 times. So whether you're voting from your landline, we're going to be following. Whether you're voting from your cell phone, we're going to be following. And if you're going to be voting online, we're going to be following as well. So we will tally all of those votes electronically, and then NCDOT will certify those votes at the end of this voting period. And then we will make a final announcement this fall that will correlate with the uh, groundbreaking ceremony that will happen later this year. Again, it's a very, very exciting um, opportunity really for the public to get involved. Um, this is not something that DOT traditionally does. And today, the public is actually being a part of the foundation of this project by um, being a part <clears throat> of the face of it and the name of it. So we ask that everyone pick up there, either click, call, or go online. This has already generated a significant amount of interest. Uh, folks that I've run into over the last couple of days uh, in DOT, they're really excited about this. I hear all kinds of, uh, of different uh, uh, opinions as to which of the four names it ought to be, but the, it's done exactly what we wanted it to do. We want people to be excited about the Business 40 project. Uh, this thing is coming up. We're going to be letting this project in August of this year. And of course, the, the naming of the, of the project itself is, uh, is sort of the, the icing on the cake, if you will. And uh, we're really excited about this and what the results will be. And uh, getting back to you in the fall with, uh, with what the final outcome of the, uh, of the voting is.